this feels good. Parker, that hurts. Oh. That guy's from the actual back day of Fish Tucker Man. Today's the first day of the blue swimmer crab season here in Perth, Western Australia. So we've got some crab nets. Um, <laughs> I've actually still got bait left over from last season, you believe that? Big bone here, so I might leave that there just to <laughs> not be seasoned up. I'll be using, uh, I've got some skippy here. For some reason I had it in the freezer. Got the head, it's an oily fish. Crabs around, they're there to go around and sniff it out, just like yay, and uh, drop in the water. First pot of the season. I've actually got a different bait, old meatballs. They've gone off, been in the freezer for, ooh, for a couple of months. Yeah, the old reef balls go, a bit of scrap food. Hopefully I can turn the scrap bait into a, a good, good meal of crabs. Just gotta watch out, because some of these haven't got much rope in them. This one here. Keep that for another time. This one is a bit more deeper. Pot. I think this is just a bit too short. No, that's right. Right, oh. So we don't need to let them soak too too much. Because in the ex from experience, the crabs go in, take their food, and they run off. So I'm going to quickly test them, and see if we've got any crabs. It's always tough. First drop, first day of the season. It's coming up to the first pot. Got to use the wind, otherwise I'd run over my line. That's actually quite long, that one. If this is no good, I'll move it further up a bit. Alrighty, let's see how we go. Oh yeah. Yeah, this rope is way too long. You can usually fill them with the net. This is a blank. Yep, as, as I thought. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, this feels good. Oh, uh, it's got the metal base. Yeah, nothing here. Ugh. Nothing. A good way to start the season. Just when I thought I was out, I wasn't recording. Getting a bit depressed, but this one here just might be a size crab. Very nice to see. So I'm just actually putting my pots up, thinking, oh, I'm gonna go somewhere else. This one here might be a crab for lunch. You beauty, he's in. Woo! First crab of the season. Just thinking, ah, oh, man, this is crap. Alrighty. Let's 
get him off there, and there you go. Fine specimen of a swan or a crab. First one of the season is definitely in size. So that is <laughs> awesome sense of achievement. So the pot over now, there's crabs out here. <laughs> Potless moving. That's 20% of my catch. Can only catch five for myself. Hey, big spot on the face. One crab. I mean, I was happy to see undersized ones, but that one there was definitely a size one. Now I'm really uh, motivated. That's per usual. While I'm filming, there'll be no crabs. Yeah, what I say? Hey, oh. One crab, you know, they usually hang around together. A bit more room on the side of the body. Nothing. Bugger, that hurts. Beautiful. Come on. I want to feel them dancing in the net. This one here, there's no dancing here. Zero. Come on. Nothing. All right. Let's move these two pots a bit out. Then I'm going to trawl around for some tailor. Feels heavy. Heavy with bait. I've been soaking here for a good 10 minutes. obvious no crabs around well at this time of year they're in the really deep water but I haven't got that extra long rope it's a bugger so I'm gonna move in riding close see Kings Park right there Mount Spray Road and it's like five meters so that's pretty deep close in but there's a nice Big drop off here. Just gonna try and find it. It's five meters. Oh, I don't know if my nets are long enough. But uh, yeah, just gonna dump it right here. Concentrate the bait smell. It's even the tail a bit tough. Trying around the place, there's a lot of jellyfish. Yeah, I think I might um, turn back and test out the pots. Yeah, nothing, man. Feels good. Feels good. Feels good. Zero. Damn. Yes. 
I purposely didn't film. Every time I film, I don't catch a crab. Now this guy here probably be an undersized one. It's a good sign though. Quickly throw this guy over. Well, I hope he's not undersized. But just experience tells me he's a male. Oh, look, he's, 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 he's undersized. Just, but still, undersized is undersized. Alrighty. It's a good sign though, at least. Brought him right in close. It's gotta be a size amongst them. Yeah, here we go. So, getting smaller. So that's three, one keeper. <laughs> Two undersized. So obviously it's very early for the season. Whoa, that crab, he was on the outside. Uh, and he might be a keeper. He wants to dance first. He might be a keeper. Now, yeah, where's my gauge? All amongst all this rubble. Come on. Come on. Woo! Oh, he sighed. And I felt it straight away. Gee, I hope the camera's not too wet. Felt it straight away and it was just hanging on the edge. So I'm just about to move too, I don't know why. So there you go. That's to the man. Now it's time to open up the beer. What I'm going to do is actually throw them in debt over again. Bugger it. Um, when there is some life, there is always hope. When there's hope, there's a bag limit. <laughs> Righto, so they're starting to come. This one here is another small one. I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna tease myself to measure them up. So that's awesome. So I'm just concentrating all my nets in the one area. And all, all eggs in the one basket. Hopefully uh, the crabs can sniff out or the bait. As I said, time for a beer. So I've just got my lures now, now trolling, but I see a few birds diving down, but the water's just packed with jellyfish. Alrighty. So there is fish out here. I think it's just come off. I think it's just come off and it was a good tailor. It was a good tailor. Oh. Come on, there should be another one coming up. Good fish, just didn't stick on. Right on the surface, shook his head and bang on. Really good fish. Now that's got my blood pumping again. There's a few little birds flying around the place. Can't see any bust ups. But I mean, after that one hookup, there's got to be some tailor and bait fish around. Probably not in big numbers. Because those lures would have taken off by now. Let's try these nets. Bit of colour in that. Nothing. Just the two blue swimmer crabs. Two males, one lost his leg already. Early on in the season, but still, I'd really do a nice cook up. I think you know what I'm going to do. Being a fellow Italian, I love them. See you home for the cook up. Let's go. Let's get 
get into the cooker. I'm just going to clean it. Taking off the carapace. Get rid of all the guts and the gills. Oh, you like to crack them in half? Give this a good rinse. There we have it. Now, of course, I've only got the two crabs. Have some of these cockles. Nice olive oil in a fry pan and garlic. Straight away, some crushed up tomatoes. The whole lot in. Dab of salt. Let that cook for about 10 minutes. Fresh, fresh basil from the garden. One small chili. I'm going to cut this in half. Half a chili. Yeah, don't forget the white wine. This is a sparkling Moscato, so it's quite sweet. Alrighty, let's get stuck in with the crabs. They're crabs. Absolutely blue manners. <laughs> the quality is pretty small. Not much I can do about that. At the same time, I'm going to throw in these cockles. Now, they will spit out a lot of juice, but that's alright. Just let the steam together. There we go. Now these cockles were frozen, so I just hope they open up. They should do. They should do. There we go. And I reckon a bit more wine. And one for the chef. Salud. Yeah, nice. Oh yeah, they've opened up. Just on cue, crabs are turning red, everything's all cooking to perfection. I just put in the secret recipe linguine <laughs> into the hot water. Now I don't want to overcook these because they become dry. So I'm just going to actually turn this right, right now and just try one of these cockles. Mmm. Not bad, they're yeah, frozen, you can taste they're frozen, but they're pretty good in the sauce of the crabs. Oh yeah, really good. There we go. Taste test time. Voila. I don't think I should taste it because there's not much crabs here. And I've got the family over. So, take my word for it. Don't want petite. See you next time. Stuff it. Oh, I'll have a taste test. I'll have a taste test. Just on the spaghetti though. Oh yeah. Right here. That bit there. Crack it open. Beautiful. I'll show you. Oh, yeah. Beautiful white meat. I'll just take this little bit. Oh. Oh. See you next time. Take it easy. Fish. Tucker. Fish. Tucker. Fish. Tucker, man. Fish. Tucker. Fish. Tucker. The fish, sucker, the fish, sucker, man.